Good morning, y'all. On the move, it's a little after seven. Slept okay last night, but my sleeping pad has yet another fucking hole in it. I think this is number seven. It's been deflating just a little bit each night for the last probably five days at least. I didn't worry about it too much, but this morning I was on the floor when I got up, so definitely a hole. Kind of sucks because yesterday there were a bunch of little lakes that I passed that would have been perfect to float it in and find a leak, but I don't know if we have any of those today. If we do, I'm definitely going to try to patch it up on trail if I can. I'm going to plan for another 25, 26. Seems to be what's working best for me at the moment. Feet and ankles are still really sore. I've been doing the stretches each night and a little bit in the morning when I feel I have time. Um, and I think it helps, but <clears throat> usually the mornings are pretty rough. Other than that, I don't got too much else. Let's see where today takes us. Walking up on this cabin here, I'm just gonna check it out. Seems like a lot of people stay here throughout the year for whatever activities they're doing on trail. snack break here with CC at this cabin it's a pretty cool spot It'd be a cool place to stay got a wood stove and everything it's pretty clean got my ramen cold soaking plan to stop for lunch in about an hour and still got a few more miles to water it was like a 10 mile carry it's not too bad but actually there's water here at the cabin I didn't realize it was a water source but we can pass right by this one I guess Just got out here to this dirt road and someone said a bunch of sodies out for us. And they must have just been here because it was a full case and it's still cold. So whoever it was, thank you. Much needed. Had a lunch, ramen, a bunch of snacks as always. We're about 13 miles in for the day, hoping to do at least 25. So far, a lot of these miles have been pretty cruisy, so I feel like I can get that done, no problem today, hopefully. I did take some Motrin from my foot, which is still really bothering me. Other than that, nothing noteworthy. Just dried all my stuff out yet again. It seems like the condensation is just going to be bad in Washington. Fireball passed by a little bit ago. And yeah, that's about it. Just moving and moving. Forward progress. I've got just over 40 miles to the next resupply point, which is Snoqualmie Pass. There's only a few small businesses there. One of them is an inn where I sent a resupply box from Bend. So it's another stop where I don't have to worry about buying food. Just pick up my box and go. I don't know if I'm gonna stay in Snoqualmie or not. You know, at this inn, I think that's really the only, the only option of places to stay unless you hitch into Seattle, which I don't know if I'm gonna do that either.
cruising along still. It's all downhill to the next water source. Definitely need to stop there and grab for the night and for the morning. I think we've only got about a mile and a half to where I'm planning on camping. I'm not sure if there's gonna be room or not. It says there's only room for two tents. But uh, I feel like most of the people that we've been bouncing around with are behind me still today. But I could be wrong, who knows. There's a lot of dirt roads and tent sites up ahead. So if I need to go a little farther, that's fine. But I am gonna plan on stopping around seven or so if possible. All right, y'all, we're here at the campsite. It's right by a road. There's a couple cars parked out there, but it's the best we're gonna get today, I guess. There was one sodi left. So I'm gonna drink that with my din din right after I get this stupid tent set up. All right guys, it's the end of another lovely day here at this campsite with uh, CC and Fireball. Chap is still ahead. Um, today we did like, maybe a hair over 27. So pretty good day. Happy with that. Still got to camp early. Still slept in. My feet are killing me though. Um, tomorrow's definitely a uh, ibuprofen in the morning kind of day and it's just going to be what it is for a little bit i think so other than that it was a good day and uh excited for tomorrow i'll see you guys then have a good one take care